11 of the 12 days of Christmas. So we are going to be foiling today with our Gemini foil press by Crafters Companion. So I like to really let my um, foil stamps heat up. So I'm just going to do that. I haven't set a time or anything, but I just like to let some heat get to it. And then um, for about maybe a minute, and then I'll go ahead and set my timer. And yeah, I just find that when you um, have the, the, you really heat the dies that they, um, you get a better, better foiling. Um, yes, you run the risk of over foiling, but my foiling experience, mm -hmm, I'm doing good. So, so I'm just going to go ahead now and set this to 45 seconds. Okay, so I have this set at 45 seconds and it's there and I'm going to go ahead and press start. All right, so the 45 seconds is done. And then now what I'm going to do, I am going to place my foil and I'm using the silver holographic um, iridescent foil. And then I am going to get my card. I'm sorry. Okay, so here's my card. And then I am going to cover this and run this through my machine, my Gemini. Okay, I'm gonna run this back in. Take this off, please be careful when removing All right, and then I'm gonna go ahead and set my tree on here. And I'm just gonna let some heat get to that before I hit start. And this is what it looks like. So, I am going to reveal it. Perfect, okay. So now, um, I'm going to go ahead and do this. So I'm going to press start. And then, um, the I'm not following the foil press book. I'm not following this because I do my foiling. I play around a lot with it. And my method usually works as you can see i have a perfect foil so this one here should be the same and we are going to be using this one here the go press and foil and this is the gold and i am going to also be using the same um 65 pound uh card stock so i'm gonna take that off my card is big enough. Okay. So I'm place that on. I hope my card is big enough. Yeah, it is. Okay. And then let's run this through our Gemini. Okay. And then we have one more that we are going to foil with, which is the deer one. And then we can start assembling our cards. So place this back. And again, be careful. And 
this is what it looks like. Okay, and then I'm gonna take the deer one, place that on, give it some heat for a minute. And then this one, here's our reveal. Another perfect one. And I am not following the book. You, what I learned from having my foil press is that you really have to play around with it. Be prepared to use a lot of foil if you're going to do that. So, yeah. But as you can see, mine's is working. So the paper that I'm going to foil on for this deer, this is actually um, Spectrum Noir paper. And this is just the Spectrum Noir paper that I use to stamp and color with alcohol markers. So I'm going to be foiling this one. Okay. And then I am going to be using this from Crafters Companion, the disco ball foil. I hope this is wide enough. Looks like it. Okay. So, and then the cardstock here, and then we are going to run this through our Gemini. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And I think, I don't know, I see a little patchy here, but we'll see. So I'm going to move this to the side and I'm gonna let that cool for a couple of seconds because I don't know how that one came out. I'm seeing a little bubble there. So again, And let's go ahead and see our results for this. Perfect. So if you guys like my foiling, let me know. I'll do more foiling videos for you guys. Um, there's a little bit of over foiling here, but um, I rather have a little bit here that I can cut off than to have a big old patch here, you know? So let's go ahead and assemble our cards so i'm just cutting this down so i'm just gonna cut them like this here i'm just gonna cut here and here Okay, and then for this one, I'm just gonna cut like a square. So here is my deer, and I just cut it out, and this is a six by six card, and I'm going to adhere this here, and then I cut some snowflakes out in some um, silver mirror foil paper, and I'm going to glue those around. So for my um, nativity, I have um, an A2 size card and I layered it with some starry background and I'm going to just place this here in the middle.
Okay, so I'm gonna place that wig right here. And then I cut out two stars. And if you take the star, I'm going to put some adhesive on one. And I'm gonna take the other one and I am going to offset it. And then now you have what looks like that beautiful star right there. So I'm gonna put that right there. Okay. And then I have some more little stars that I'm gonna put around. And then for the final card here, we're going to place this like this. Okay. And this one, I'm not going to embellish or add anything to it because it speaks clearly it speaks loudly with just the beautiful look at the little stars and it's just so pretty so i accent i accented this with the gold foil paper and some black and uh, matte gold snowflake paper that i had so that's that one super pretty right and then we have the nativity I just added my little stars and then we have the deer so I added my snowflakes so pretty basic but beautiful foil press cards so I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you guys pull out your foil press machines and foil for Christmas thank you so much for watching I'll see you at midnight for the final day.